Hey, what's up? I'm Chelsea of Friday Pattern Company, and today I wanted to introduce you to our newest sewing pattern, the Provenant Pullover. It is a pullover jacket that has welt pockets. It's got a half front placket that you can do snaps or buttons on, and then the, the sleeves and the hem are brought in with elastic, so it has this kind of oversized, comfortable fit that is great for a lot of different things. So it's a pretty versatile pattern. You can make it in any sort of woven fabric, like we recommend maybe a mid-weight woven, and you can also make it in stable knit fabrics, so like a French terry or something like that. Another cool thing about the Poganip is that it features an optional back packable pocket. So if you add this, you can pack your, your jacket down into this pocket. So I'll show you. So it packs up and then it has a little handle right here. So this is great if you brought this like camping or something. You could honestly use this as a pillow if you wanted. I guess it depends on the fabric you use. It's an optional feature, so if you don't want it, don't worry about it, but I think it's pretty fun. The pattern is available in our full size range, extra small through 7X, so that is up to a 60 inch chest. This is an intermediate level pattern, and that's mostly because of the welt pockets, which are challenging, but we really break it down for you in the instructions and then in the video so along. We're gonna go into detail and I promise that you can do them. They just might take some practice, but yeah. So this is an intermediate level pattern, but I would encourage if you are a beginner or a confident beginner, watch this all along, see what you think. It's doable for anyone. So if you wanna level up, try the Pokemon. So I just wanna go over really quickly the photo shoot samples. We have this fuchsia version that's made from pre-quilted fabric. We have a blog post going live that breaks down how to make your own quilted fabric. If you wanna make a quilted one and you can't find pre-quilted fabric, then we've got some resources for you. It's a fun way to like create a textile and I've been having a lot of fun making quilted fabric to make garments out of. So it, you should check that out if you wanna get inspired. The fuchsia version is a size medium with no adjustments. That model is 5'7". And then the this linen cotton version, this floral fabric is from Fabric Godmother and it's a linen viscose. So this is like a more drapey version and I love how it looks in this fabric. This model is wearing an XXL based on her measurements. She is five foot nine. This denim version that I made, I actually decided to size up one for it. So I would normally make a medium based on my measurements. I made a size large because I wanted to make sure I could fit like a really comfy big sweater underneath it. And I can wear this with like a hoodie under it or anything like that. And I also thought with the way that the denim looks that it would be fun to have it be a little bit bigger and i love this jacket so much i have been wearing it like every day it has kind of a sporty vibe but i've found that it styles really well with a lot of things so here's a few of the, the ways that i styled it i wore it with jeans and a sweatshirt this is like casual sporty everyday look i this this outfit is with like a black mini skirt tights and boots and this is cute for like feeling a little bit sassier. No, I don't know, hanging out with friends. It looks really cute over my silk chiffon wilder gown, which was a surprise to me. I love the way that the wilder gown neckline looks popping out of the top. And this was just like, I thought this was a cool outfit and I'm definitely going to be wearing this quite a bit. Uh, and then this last one is it with the saguaro set pants. And this kind of reminded me of like, you know those like all windbreaker outfits that uh, people wore like on their like speed walks? Uh, this kind of reminded me of that, the like all denim version, which was kind of fun. And I think this is really cute. Like how cute would I be at the grocery store in this outfit? <laughs> we have an intro blog post that has some ready to wear inspiration, some fabric inspiration, and a lot of the details about the pattern that you can check out. We'll link that down below. And yeah, this is a really cool pattern and I hope that you love it. And yeah, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. We'll have a whole separate video for the sew along. Hello, this is Chelsea from The Next Day. So we've had a bit of change of plans. We're going to do a video that just goes over the welt pocket details and then we'll do another video that is the full sew along. We wanted to 
um, make a video that's just dedicated to the welt pockets because it is the most challenging part of the pattern and what makes it more of an intermediate level pattern. So to make sure that that feels achievable for you, we wanna go over it in like really small detail. So we'll first have the welt pocket video and then next week we'll be doing this full sew along video.